lovely people and from both me and my uh, situation up here <laughs> of us uh, fine it is Thursday I'm off work and I was off work yesterday as well I am traveling tomorrow for one of my friends wedding I'm gonna be a bridesmaid which is also why I have this um, weave um, in my hair it's a quick weave that I got done yesterday I spent six hours at the beauty salon for a quick weave uh, but not but they did it in a way that I felt like I was getting a wig installed like it was very meticulous of a of a quick weave so they actually did a great job it, you wouldn't even be able to tell this is literally like a four by four closure like not if you if you know much about weave uh not um something that like it's really just something that I got it's because the, the style is going to be a, a ponytail it's gonna be a low ponytail so I just needed to be able to just put it in a ponytail and and then I'll wear the hair for maybe a couple weeks total and and then be able to be done with it anyway I'm on my way to my sister's house my sister and her husband are celebrating their anniversary this weekend it's their seventh anniversary I think 2017 18 19 20 21 22 23 24 seventh anniversary so they are traveling and um, uh, her husband's mom her mother-in-law is in town along with um, his, her husband's brothers will be in town too uh, but for this morning the kids have school and so I'm it's about six almost it's almost seven I'm at about 6 45 must be at their house Get the, get the girls ready and drop them off at school and then um, go about my some things that I need to do today and come back uh, get to pick them up at three so she gave me all the rundown all the instructions everything um, and the oldest one is going to kind of help me because she's like a boss in a good way and a bad way sometimes <laughs> but I'm gonna help get them ready and do a little school drop off so um yeah that's what i'm doing this morning i have a lot of energy i haven't eaten anything i just woke up and i'm just ready to go and then after i'm done with them i'll find some breakfast and we got we got places to go okay so you guys strap in and um let's have a great day Okay, <laughs> I look a little different. The car is empty. Everybody's dropped off. And that was interesting. Um, dropped the big girl off at big girl school elementary, and then the other two at daycare. I'm about to go switch out cars and be on my way. Okay, so um, it has been a heck of a day and a very annoying day enough that I was just like, didn't even um, vlog, stop the vlogging because uh, after I finished dropping the girls, I took my car to get an oil change. I thought it was, it was supposed to be a couple hours. Literally, it took like six hours. I, and eventually left and went back to my sister's house, which was not close by got her car did the errands I needed to do got my eyebrows done they look fantastic got some target pickup shoes for the wedding I got a couple pimple patches the invisible ones which are awesome you can't even barely tell that it's on to try and get rid of this thing that's growing on my face uh, I went to Ulta to get something that uh, my nanny had asked for I went to home goods to get dining um, dining um, stuff dining uh, like plates jesus like plates t uh placemats and silverware for the dining table so i want to when i get back come back on sunday so on monday memorial day i'm off so i want to that's like a project that i want to do that day to so just kind of tablescape it and see what it what it'll look like um but yeah so now i'm back in the neighborhood of my sister i'm about to pick the girls up and take them to their house and then i'm gonna uber myself back to my car so that then I can come back home. It has been a long day, y'all. I did a pit stop at home to drop all the stuff off that I bought. Saw my baby, my sweet, sweet, precious baby, who does not really recognize me with this hair. He be looking at me twice. Um, but anywho, 
that's that's the catch up and i was just i was too annoyed to even you, you, anyway it was so many different things even like the lift like to get where i was going to get like to get back to my sister's place the just so many things so many things i just prayed to god i said god i'm just trusting you with this day i'm just laying this day at your feet um because i can't i can't kill myself so He's been taking care of me and I am right on time, about to pull in to pick up my precious sweet babies. Got everything? All right, let's go. A crazy day has come to an end. Um, this day was just wild. Um, I got the baby down and I just had to finish two notes that I had still remaining since from Wednesday, no, from Tuesday. And that usually never happens, but oh, I don't know. So just finish those and Chris has all these things he wants to do with me because I'm leaving tomorrow. And so I'm gonna spend the rest of the evening with him. Um, I'm gonna take these things off. A little bit more visible now since I, sh I showered with them. I don't even know if you're supposed to do that or not, but you're supposed to leave it for eight hours. So anyway, so I'll spend the rest of the night with my husband. Um, everything is done. We're going to decorate our dining table. The stuff I bought that I wanted to do on Memorial Day when I got back, um, he wants to do it now. So he's too excited about the decorations. And so he wants to set the table now. So we shall do it now. All right, this is the before. Got the plates, silver, napkins, rings, table mats. progress we have the plates and the place settings we're going to work on the napkins now um chris said that he ironed these um but they are not ironed i watched him iron them but i'm just confused <laughs> This is the progress so far. Um, just have to do the silverware now. Okay, time for the reveal. This is it, what do you guys think? Um, put gold on the napkin rings to kind of match with the little, the table base and the gold on the wall pieces, um, but try to keep everything mostly neutral. We touched down in Cleveland, got into our rooms. We are attached to the bridal suite. So some of the other girls are over there with the bride. I just wanted to do a quick check-in. We got some food and um, we are heading to the, get ready for the rehearsal dinner, which is in about two hours. Um, and get my hair a little bit together, shower, get myself together. I really wanted to take a nap, but I don't think that's gonna happen. Too much energy, you know? 
Uh, but yeah, we're here. Just made it to the rehearsal dinner menu. Y'all had to change my shoes. I'm about to tear the dance floor up. Okay, up. <laughs> this shrimp is cute. Is that cute? Is that cute? Not your dad. Everything went great last night with the wedding and slept in, just finished getting breakfast. We are making our trek back to the hotel up this hill. And then we're gonna head to the airport and I'll see you guys back in Houston. This hair did well. I can remember it was a quick weave, although it was a long quick weave, but um, it held up well, did really well during the wedding. It still looks okay. I mean, the closure is certainly closuring, um, but I'm not mad at it. I could be, probably wear it for a week, maybe this coming weekend. Um, we'll have our nanny here with us and I'll probably take it out. Actually, yeah, because I have a birthday dinner Friday and then I'm gonna take it out. I'm trying to I'll probably take it out next weekend because two weeks, no, I don't think we're gonna, I don't think we're gonna make it. What's up y'all? I'm back in town from the wedding and have a surprise day off of work. Uh, I didn't, I forgot that when I was originally requesting, I had a requested an extra day off like today, which is Tuesday after Memorial Day. So I had, like done everything last night, packed my lunch, got everything ready. I was like, let me check my schedule just to kind of get an idea of what I'm in for. And I was like, oh, my schedule's cool. Like I don't have, I don't have clinics. So I was like, bet. Um, I had a slow morning. I took the wig off that I was, or the, I took the weave out that I wore to the wedding. Right now I just have braids. Um, I just couldn't do it. I'm not a weave person anymore. I don't know. I was so uncomfortable. So I took that out and um, just came from working out. And I'm about to go run a few errands. I have some um, dry cleaning. Um, I'm going to finally buy Namdi's new car seat. Um, I want to get a 360 car seat and have some stuff that I need to donate to Goodwill and grocery shopping and get gas. So I'm going to do those things and come back home, probably try and make some food. I plan on making stew and making some salmon. We have rice. Um, yeah. That's my plans. Hey, 
Started the day hot, high energy, did all my errands, everything, knocked it all out. Just finished cooking. I made stew, I made pasta and um, spaghetti sauce for Namdi and um, stew for the adults. I put one too many habanero peppers in that stew. It's a little too spicy for me, honestly, but uh, that means my husband probably will really like it. Um, I'm tired. I hit a wall. Um, just gave Namdi to the nanny after playing with him for about 30 minutes. And I'm about to lay down and take a nap um, before Chris gets home so I can feel some energy again. Okay, so for the car seat, I knew I was gonna get a 360 car seat. Um, I did a little bit of research between some different brands. I went with the Chico Key Fit 360. It just seemed like the best all around, had the best features. And I just installed it, uh, so I wanna show you. All right, so this is it installed. Right now it's rear facing, and then it has the uh, 360 component where you can get the baby ready. He's like straight up and down. It's not like another one I saw where they're like, when it's this, they're like kind of leaning lopsided. Also, it has these little pockets where you can keep the clips, which I thought was great to just get, you know, it just can be ready to go. This flexes forward. So like the like with the Duna, that was something he was, I was always getting stuck under him. So it just makes that easier. Um, and then this is a magnetic clip. So like, it's so much easier so i love that so those are my those are a few of the most my favorite ones features that i didn't see in the other car seats and then this little like clip thing i think is so cute once you're done you can just it's very conveniently located because that was definitely something we were doing all the time so yes we are ready to roll of course we are still um and you can turn it with one hand we're still gonna be rear facing mode, which this takes up a lot of space. I had to reduce some space here, if you can see. Um, but eventually, you know, he'll soon make his way to forward facing. But for now, of course, to be as safe as possible, we're still rear facing. So Kiko, did I say Chico earlier? Sorry, Kiko. I love this. I'm excited to break it in. <laughs> 